एवरीवन टुडे वी आर गोइंग टू स्टडी चैप्टर नंबर टू नंबर वर्क प्रॉब्लम सेट नंबर फाइव इन टुडेज वीडियो वी आर गोइंग टू स्टडी अबाउट द एक्सपांडेड फॉर्म हाउ टू राइट द एक्सपांडेड फॉर्म ऑफ द गिवन डिजिट्स एंड हाउ टू फाइंड द प्लेस वैल्यू ऑफ द digits okay so place value of the digits we have already done in the previous video if you all haven't watched the videos the link will be provided in the description box you all can check it over there so let's start with the first question write the place value of the underlined digit okay now only underlined digit place value you all have to write not other numbers you all have to write so how are you going to find the place value it's very easy i have already shown this in the previous video also Unit tens, hundred, thousand, ten thousand, lakh, and ten lakh. Okay, so seven is at the place of which ten lakh. Okay, now how are you going to write the place value, children? It's very easy. First, write seven. Okay, and. After seven, the remaining numbers with the commas you all have to write. Okay, don't forget about the commas. I have also so shown why we have to write the commas in between the numbers. So after seven, put a finger over here, and the remaining numbers you all have to add that many zeros. Okay, so it is in the ten lakhs place. Seven is in the ten lakhs place, and this is the place value of the digit. Isn't it easy? Now next one four nine five two one zero. So again, unit tens, hundred, thousand, ten thousand, lakh, and ten lakh. Okay, so four is at the lakhs place, isn't it? So how are you going to write four? Only the value of four. One we don't have to write. So for the value of four, what you all have to write? Four first. Okay. Then put a finger over here, and the remaining zeros. That is two zeros over here, and then you all can read and check. Unit tens, hundred thousand, ten thousand lakh. So four is at the lakhs place. Got it? So in this form, you all have to write the place value of the underlined digit, and this is the short form, children. Okay. If you all want to write it in the long form, you all can do it in that way. I'll show you in the textbook. They have given it. In this way also, you all can write it. Okay, page number six. They have given us. You all can write it in this way also. No problem. This whatever is been given over here, I have written it in the short form. I hope the short form is easy to write because how lengthy are you going to write the spellings and all? So write the short forms. Take the number that has been given to you all. Write the place value and finish it off. Okay. Now the next number is five. So again, unit tens, hundred, thousand. Ten thousand and lakh. So we don't need any other number. We only need five. So take five, okay, and up, put a finger on the five and remaining zeros. That is one zero, and after that three zeros. Unit tens, hundred, thousand, ten thousand. So five is at the ten thousands place. Zero. There is no place, no place value for the zero. So it is going to be zero only. Next. Unit tens, hundred, thousand, ten thousand, lakh, and ten lakh. Okay, so nine has been underlined, isn't it? So when nine has been underlined, you all have to only take nine. Okay, put a finger over here, and the remaining numbers add zeros. This is the easiest way to write the place value. No other way I I can think of to put it in a such a easy way other than this. Okay, so this is the easiest way. Follow this method. The marks are going to be the same. The teacher is not going to shout at you. Okay, you can explain the teacher that I have already written it in the short form. No need to write in the long form. Okay, so this is the question number one is complete. Next, write the numbers in the expanded form. Now, for writing in the expanded form, same method we have to use. Now, why I have used that method, children, so that we don't need to change the method at every question. We need to use the same method. So, this method was been explained in the first exercise also, and in the fifth exercise also, we are doing the same method. So, I have not changed the writing method so that you all find it easy to write it. Okay, now. Write the numbers in the expanded form. It's also very easy. Same as we did, thousand, ten thousand, lakh, and 
10 lakh okay now we have to write the expanded form now expanded form as same as we did the question number one okay but over here we have to only write the plus sign between the numbers so first take five okay put a finger how many zeros that many zeros you all have to add it okay plus next number is six so take six put a finger over here write remaining zeros 6, uh, 1, 2, 3, 4, 5, 1, 2, 3, 4, 5, okay, okay, so 6,000, we have, 6 lakh, we have written, now 4,000, 40,000, you all have to write, so 40,000 for that, write 4, then take 1, 0, 40,000, then 3,000, plus sign, don't forget to put the plus sign, then take number 3, Put a finger over here then add three zeros the zeros are going to reduce okay nothing else plus 200 plus 10 plus 5 okay so 50 lakh 6 lakh 40,000 3,200 10 and 5 this is known as the expanded form and this is the method that I have shown from the very starting now let's do the second one Unit tens, hundred, thousand, ten thousand. Okay, so seven I will write, put a finger, add the zeros. Okay, so one, two, three, four. Got it? Now, zero only once you all can add it, no problem. Okay, you all don't have to add four zeros to it. One zero is more than enough. Plus eight hundred, plus ten, plus five that's it okay so when you read it you should be able to get that number exactly the same next unit tens hundred thousand ten thousand lakh <coughs> excuse me so eight lakh for that how many zeros two three four five okay five zeros plus thirty thousand so Four zeros plus five thousand. So three zeros plus nine hundred plus ninety plus nine. Okay, so whatever the digit has been given according to the value, you all have to add the zeros and add just plus sign between these numbers so that when you add this, so when you add all these numbers together, you are going to get this name a number. Okay. Unit tens, hundred, thousand, ten thousand, lakh. So, eight lakh. Put one zero, put finger over there and then add your zeros. Take another eight, that is eighty thousand. So, eight and then the remaining zeros. Okay. Eight lakh sorry 80,000 so it is going to be uh, yes it is right then we have to write for 8,000 okay plus 800 plus 80 plus 9 next is unit tens 100,000 10,000 lakh and 10 lakh so 9 90 lakh so this is the way it is going to look okay how many zeros 1 2 3 4 5 6 in the next number 2 you all have to write and how many zeros 5 zeros so in this way okay next is 3000 30000 so this is going to be your 3 put one finger 1 2 3 4 4 zeros so 1 2 3 4 Okay, so four zeros. Then two thousand. Two thousand means how many zeros? Three zeros. So one, two, three zeros. Plus nine hundred, nine hundred. So easy. We can write it. Plus ninety, plus two. So don't get confused about how many zeros to add. Even if you all don't remember, this is the easiest trick. You all can do it. Put one finger and then after the numbers, the numbers are there. That many zeros you all have to add it. Okay, now question number three is write the place name 
the place value of each each digit in the following numbers now as we did the first question in the same way you all have to do it children first i will write all the digits that is 3 okay then we will write 5 7 0 and 5 okay so in this way i have written all the numbers now we have to write the place name okay so this is in the units place tens hundreds you all can write it in short form also as i have said thousand and 10000 Okay, so ten thousand. Now you all have to write the place value. So this is going to be five. Go ulta. Then zero as it is. This is seven hundred. So this is going to be its value. This is going to be five thousand. So five thousand. And then th three. Uh, three is going to be thirty thousand. So got it, children? Isn't it easy? So in this form, you all have to write the place value of the numbers also now again now there here are big big numbers so i will write 7 8 289 okay so we will write it in short form also so that it will be clear to you all units tens hundreds thousand this is Ten thousand, this is lakhs. Okay, so nine ninety eight hundred two thousand eighty thousand and seven lakh. So in this way, got it, children? you all can add a line over here so that it will not get mixed up now next 8274508 so units place tens hundreds thousand seven is 10000 this is lakhs and this is 10 lakh you all can prepare a table also if it is necessary now 8050407002 lakh and Eighty lakhs. Got it. So eighty two lakh seventy four thousand five hundred and eight. Now we have to do ulta of this expanded form. We expanded form has been given to us. We have to write the digits. It is very easy. Again the same type unit tens hundred thousand ten thousand and lakh. Write the units so that we can fill in the numbers. So nine units, seventy six hundred four thousand and sixty thousand. Okay, lakhs is not been given, so we will reduce it. Now next number, unit tens hundred thousand ten thousand lakh. So five. Now tens is not been given. Okay, be careful about these number. Tens is not been given, so what we have to write? We have to take zero. Okay. So when you take zero over here for hundreds place, eight will come. Okay, seven thousand twenty thousand. So this is going to be in between ten thousand. Okay, and nine lakh. Okay, so check whether your answer is right. Nine lakh twenty seven thousand eight hundred and five. Yes, it is right. Now next number is going to be very big. So unit tens hundred thousand ten thousand lakh and ten lakh. Okay, so first we will write seven, then ten. So one, 
फाइव हंड्रेड सो फाइव नाइन थाउजेंड सो नाइन सिक्सटी थाउजेंड सो सिक्स विल कम ओवर यर थ्री लैक्स मीन्स थ्री विल कम ओवर यर एंड ट्वेंटी लैक सो टू विल कम ओवर यर ओके एड योर कॉमर्स रीड इट एंड द आंसर इज गोइंग टू बी राइट नेक्स्ट यूनिट टेंस हंड्रेड थाउजेंड टेन थाउजेंड एंड लैक so you will see unit is nothing given so zero ten nothing has been given so zero but five hundred has been given so five hundred four thousand eighty thousand seven lakh okay so seven lakh eighty four thousand five hundred got it isn't it easy to write children but follow the same rule as we have done for all the exercises now the next one is unit tens Hundred, thousand, ten thousand, lakh, ten lakh. Okay, so nine has been given. That is in the units place. Then tens has not been given. So zero, six hundred. So six thousand means one will come over here. Fifty thousand. So five will come over here, and then eighty lakh. Okay, lakh has not been given. the place of lakh is not given so we have to write zero and this way so count the numbers now 1 2 3 4 5 6 1 2 3 4 5 6 isn't it right yes it is right so 80 lakhs 51609 so your your exercise is over practice these sums and let me know in the comment section children you all are not commenting so i am not able to understand whether you all have understood the exercise or no i would love to hear from you all so please do comment in the comment section whether you all have understood or no see you in the next video till then take care bye